Yeah, the first thing I remember about BOC, like the very first thing was when I was looking for my group at the bus stop. I just remember I was just wandering around, but then that's all of a sudden I saw this like great group of people coming from the school towards the bus stop, just screaming, like holding props. It was like, oh man, I have to approach these guys and say that I am from their group, you know. Yeah, that was a, uh, that was a, uh, it was, it came as a shock at like, how friendly they were and how easy going. I tried to adopt that mentality over the next few days and just have fun. For me, like in year one, every week is a new topic. So you got about a week to digest that topic and you must be able to do your homework and uh, master it by the next week. So that one can be very challenging at times because if you like don't understand that concept, you can't move on to the following week's topic because most of the time it's linked. Learning to do that was a challenge because I always figured I would get it at the end of revision period or what. Then when I have to do my revision, I realized that I have no idea what's going on. Over time, like I learned how to manage that much better. Once we come to poly, it's like more of independence. That part I had to struggle a bit because it's really if I don't push myself, no one will push me. Because of all these camps and activities, I actually made a lot more friends and some of my closest friends came from these, these trips. So the company I'm attached to during my internship is a biotechnology company. Basically, this company ships biological samples. Uh, so for like group projects, every time before you submit your project, you have to sign like a plagiarism report. So your signature is needed for that. So there was one report where we were submitting on that day, which I forgot to sign my name. So I was having my training that day also. So I'm in the field getting ready to go on. Then my friends are calling me and then they say, I haven't signed yet. And I totally forgot about it. So I had to like excuse myself and then run up the hill all the way to the BA office and then sign it for them in my boots and then run back down to my field to continue. I may not be the valedictorian for this year's graduation ceremony, but I just hope that everyone here has at least enjoyed their time in poly and the main thing that we can all take away from this experience is our friends and hopefully these friendships that we've made for the past few years will be able to last through the rest of our lives. So uh, I'm sure everyone is afraid of what's the future going to hold and what we're going to do in our lives. So I think it's best that we uh, do what we like rather than do what everyone else is doing in the sense that the job you're going to be doing is like probably going to be permanent for a few years at least. So don't do something and rush into it and then regret later. So take your time, enjoy your vacation after graduating and I wish you all the best. Success is dictated by yourself and academic success is not everything. It doesn't matter what your GPA is, just always remember to practice the correct GPA. Gratitude, perseverance and adventurousness. Happy graduation!